We are now done with the background. Next, let's see how to bring the puppy into this background. I'm going to bring the Make New Sprite block from the tool section and set it here. Now we have a sprite but it's not what I want. So I'm going to click on the arrow here. There are several sprites here but not the one I like. So I'm going to click on costumes and click on new costumes and type dog dog. Then I'm going to select this puppy. I don't need the puppy here but rather I need the puppy for my coding. So I'm going to click on the code on the left corner. Still the sprite has not changed. I'm going to click on this arrow again and select this puppy. So by now I have also brought the puppy into this project. Though the puppy is near the door, I need it near the road. So I will click on this yellow color icon and bring it to the road. Now we are done with the puppy. Next is the bone. Go and bring the make new sprite block from the tools section and set it here. I need the sprite showing a bone so I am going to click on the arrow here. There are several sprites here but not the one I want. So I am going to click on costumes and click on new costumes and type B O N E bone. Then I am going to select this bone. I don't need the bone here but rather I need the bone for my coding. So I am going to click on the code and then click on the arrow and select the bone. Now we have the bone too. But I need the bone near the road and not near the door. So I will click on the icon again and bring the bone to the road. Okay, so by now we have set the background and also brought the puppy and the bone into the project. Next, let's see how we can get this puppy to move towards the bone.